Welcome back to the Tracy Trendy Show, my lovelies. It's another day. It's another dollar in. It's some more locker. Some more lockup, some more pokey. My loves, you would not believe that the good non con Julian got arrested in April with Christine at the time. Yes, this is the latest couple that they introduced. And so we don't get a good feel on them yet. But basically, Christine was the bank robber, right? But uh, apparently, Julian got arrested for shoplifting. Yes, in walk places. He was up there shoplifting. And this came 11 days after Christine released. Now, Christine's release was on March 26th of 2024. So 11 days that'll put us into April. So he was arrested sometime in April of 24. So this 46-year-old man was concealing items inside and under his bags at Walmart. He had a Walmart, um, you know, one of those little tote bags, the cloth ones. He put some items in that bag and under the bag. Then he met with um, Christine at the back of the store and she had a tote bag with some merchandise in it. Then they both go up to the customer service desk. They spoke to an employee and then they just left the store without paying for the merchandise. Now, of course, people were watching them. They just didn't, they thought they were free until they saw cops confronting them. Now, Julian was the one they confronted. He tried to run away, but they, they caught up to him. And um, he was handcuffed right there on open in public. And they asked him about the woman that he was with. And he was saying, who, what girl, what girl? So that gave him an extra charge for not answering correctly and um christine was caught at a nearby pet smart and she was in confronted in the store and she admitted that julian was her boyfriend and that she had a tote bag and she just tossed it on one of the shelves at pet smart and what was in the bag you might ask my love what was in that bag well my loves it was just card games and socks retail value 69 dollars and 83 cents all that money now uh, Julian spent on Christine and all that, you would think they would have had a little coin, just a little coin. And the retail value of what he had in his bags was $546.19. There's no description of what he took. Now, they ran background checks on both of them. Apparently, Christine was clean, you know, no more warrants, no anything. She was cited for shoplifting as a shoplifting for first offense. And she was released from the scene. And, um, but Julian was arrested. He was literally, he was the one, the non-con was the one arrested for shoplifting and attempting to flee and obstructing an officer. That was because he was saying, I was obstructing justice or something. When you don't admit to, to the statements, he denied he knew Christine. So anyway, he posted his $5,000 bail. And he pleaded guilty to shoplifting and fleeing. And he was fined $422 in order to pay $1,092.38 civil penalty to Walmart. And the obstruction charge was dismissed as part of his plea deal. Uh, so why were they stealing these items? Well, apparently um, it was for a kid's birthday. So after speaking to Christine and Julian for some time, the arresting officer found that the couple is staying in Packersburg to visit Christine's daughter for a birthday party. The arresting officer found that due to the cost of getting to Parkinsburg and having to go back home to Maryland, the couple became low on money and wanted to steal things for her daughter. I'm like, what happened to the birthday card in like $20, $10? Now, they, Christine has two children. She has a 15-year-old boy. You as we heard on this episode, twins as well. They wanted to steal for a kid's birthday for Justine's daughter. And I'm like, you know what, 10 or 20 bucks, depending on the age. Shoot, $10 may seem like a lot of money. I would put a bag of candy and 10 bucks in there. Here you go. Hallelujah. And be done with it. I'm not going to try and go to Walmart and doing all this, that, and other. Please. So, anyway, my love, there you have it. Julian, the non con. 
was arrested and Christine was just released because she only had a little bit of merchandise, I guess. And then she was being honest. But there you have it, my loves. That's the low down dirt on um, mm, the latest arrest. We know we're going to get some more in the future, unfortunately, because these people stay in this. All right, my loves, I'll catch you all up on the flip side.